a three-stop strategy in car number five. He's actually a little bit further down the order, but they're both in reasonable shape. Oh, oh man, no. big problem there for Lee Holdsworth. I could see it coming. He went wide, understeered straight into the fence, has struck it hard, and that'll be a lot of damage on that car. Hopefully he can just limp home, but I doubt whether he'll survive that one. Yeah, broken front left suspension on that car. It's remarkable that the damage is visibly as little as it is. It brings to an end what's been a very solid okay, weekend. He can't even turn it, can't get it through. Such is the damage. Been really consistent. Had such high hopes with this outfit, Charlie Schwerkolt. There he is, has been smiling all weekend. First time we've seen him like this. Um, I'm driving it back to the pier. Got, um, I don't know where the damage is in the front left, I think. So I don't think there's too much damage in the rear. I'm not sure. Uh, here it is again in replay. He was well wide of the line, and there was just no way he could redeem that. Safety car boards and flag, safety car scramble, leader is car 22. So out in the grey line, no grip. Started with a being up very high from where he turned in and then the car slid and then basically just understeered into the wall. I could see it coming. And actually, the Volvo, uh, sorry, the um, Nissan behind him kind of looked at it as well. <laughs> so they're sorting the wall out at turn eight. That's the reason for the safety car deployment. It's gone in at an awkward angle. It's the front left that's the issue. They will do an inspection, obviously, under the rear of the car as well. That was a pretty big scare also for